Hi, I'm Kate McGreen for the Weekend News Rewound. Howard Stern seems a little lonelier nowadays as his once loyal 12 million listeners are lax to join him at his new home on satellite radio. No wonder. At $13 a month, is Sirius really delivering enough to justify the cost? Stern's audience has dwindled to a roughly estimated 1 or 2 million, and that's pretty optimistic considering Sirius only has 4 million subscribers. One thing that is serious? His half-billion-dollar paycheck. In an almost unbelievable story, police in Montana are investigating a couple who falsely claimed they were the new parents of sex tuplets in order to solicit charity. Sarah and Chris Everson received donations through a bank fund, a post office box set up to receive mailed gifts, and a PayPal account through which visitors to the website could give money. Sarah Everson appeared in the examiner, holding six one-piece baby photos, showed pregnancy photos of herself, and shed tears for reporters in an effort to continue the elaborate deception. Gas prices are soaring back towards the $3 mark as we start to approach the summer boating and driving season. Who's to blame? Popular politics like to point fingers at big oil and fears about the war, but economists tell us it's much simpler than that. Just look in the mirror. Now, let's rewind it and see what's news to you. Just was wondering, you know, with the rising gas prices, have people stopped driving? Yeah. Would you drive more? No. Why do you think the prices are going up? I don't know. We're talking today about Howard Stern. Do you ever listen to him? Hardly ever. Hey, did you hear about Howard Stern moving over to Sirius Radio? Yes. Half billion dollar paycheck. What do you think about that? Uh, good for Howard. He's got a half billion dollar paycheck. Do you think he's worth it? Yeah, I think he's worth it. Did you go over to Satellite with him? No. Hey, do you listen to Howard Stern at all? Uh, no. Did you hear that he got a $500 million paycheck for moving to Satellite Radio? I actually did hear that, yeah. What do you think of that? Uh, it's kind of ridiculous, I think. I was wondering if you had heard the story about those, the couple in Montana who had posed as the parents of newborn sex tuplets. No, I didn't hear about that. I was wondering if you had heard that story about the sex tuplets that were born in Montana? No. Did you hear about the woman in Montana who, her and her husband, had pretended they, were, they gave birth to sex tuplets? You know, I saw that in the paper this morning. I glanced over it. But they wanted money. Okay, again, the American dream. They told everybody that they had six babies to get donations. What do you think of that? I don't know. I don't think. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Kate McGrain. This was the week's News Rewound. Tune in next week when we rewind the news again.